What's going on guys? My name is Zen and welcome to the very first episode of my brand new Pokemon Blaze Glaze version Nuzlocke Let's Play series. I'm, I have to be honest, I'm very excited but also very scared since this is my first time attempting a Nuzlocke and I've heard from a lot of people, it's not good. But hey, I'm up for a challenge, but not too much. As you may have known from the intro. Yeah, this is kind of a different take on the Nuzlocke format. This one, we have three lives before considering a Pokemon dead. So yeah, it's like the, it's inspired by the third life SMP by Grian. If you don't know Grian, What's wrong with you? <laughs> He's a very, very good YouTuber, Minecraft YouTuber. He's just... I mean, he's just poggers, I mean, yeah. So what are we waiting for? Let's begin, let's start our first Nuzlocke journey in Pokemon Glaze version. So, let's begin. New game, oh, options. I need to make this fast and... I want blue, some a blue border. That's it. Okay, fine. I'll take. <laughs> okay, I'll take that. Okay. Okay, new game. Let's begin. Oh, a gentleman. I haven't played Pokemon Blaze Glaze before, so. This is about to be a very interesting experience, to say the least. Hello! Welcome to the Toonod region! Toonod? Is it just like... It's just Donut spelled backwards, right? Or am I imagining things? Okay, anyways. My name is Professor Willow, but most people just call me the Pokemon Professor. Okay, hello, Professor. This is what we call a Pokemon. Oh, a Turtwig! Is that one of the starters? I would want a Turtwig. <laughs> I want a Turtwig. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon, at times as friendly playmates, and at times as cooperative workmates, and sometimes we band together and battle others like us. Oh. So, Professor... the Professor is a trainer? That's interesting. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. Okay. In fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. Yes, Professor, I know. <laughs> and you are? Are you a boy or are you a girl? Um, for the sake of making this run a tad bit more interesting, I'm going to pick the girl character because I haven't played as the girl character in quite some time, so let's do this. What's your name? Um, I will name my character Asia spelled like this in honor of a very good friend of mine so yeah if you're watching this this is for you <laughs> okay I'm Asia okay let's go so it's Asia yes professor it is oh you must be the Asia I have heard so much about right professor you were literally just asking my name a few seconds ago <laughs> but okay whatever Alright, are you ready? Hell yeah, am I? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon, where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. Okay, Professor, see you there. Okay, um, we're not inside a house. This is... Very interesting way to start. Okay, who are you? Oh, 
question mark, question mark, question mark. What are you doing in a place like this? I wasn't expecting anyone to come. I'll take you back this once and explain best I can, okay? Okay. Don't be scared. I'll make sure you... I'll make sure to get you back over safely. I'm a little bit scared because I don't know who you are, but you're assuring me that everything will be fine. Seems kind of sus to me, man. Not gonna lie, but sure, okay. The trip isn't fun at all. I don't like where this is going. <laughs> where, where are you taking me? Oh, a house. This is the right place? This is. But, but how? I'll explain later. Somehow you managed to slip from your universe to mine from here. It's a good thing you appeared so close to me, or there'd be big trouble. Who are you, man? <laughs> now that you've been there, there's nothing to stop you from slipping through again, so be careful and, uh... I'm sorry, I have to go. I'll try to explain later. Bye! That guy... It's very suspicious. <laughs> Something's fishy. Okay, I can move now. Oh, this is a very nice sprite. Nice work. I like this sprite. We're dancing. Nice. Okay. Can we watch the TV? No. Can we sleep? No. How about this? It's a clock, but it needs batteries. The time is stuck at 7.14. I wonder what 7.14 means. Closet? No, okay. How about this? No. Speed potion? I can't access the PC. Okay. Okay, I guess the only way is this way. Oh, we live in the second floor. No, nothing new, really, nothing new. Oh. <gasps> we have both our parents here. This is already better than. Never mind. Okay. Mom, Asia, good to see you up and about. Your dad and I were just about to go to the store in Choco Town. That's so cool. God. We got a few things. Oh, I almost forgot. Professor Willow called earlier and asked that you come by his lab today. Okay, Professor, I'm, I'm gonna be there, don't worry. You better head over right away. Yes, Mom, I will. It's bad manners to leave someone waiting. I agree. If you make someone wait, you're wasting their time. So, yes. <laughs> okay, Mom. I love you. Make sure to stay safe. You too, Mom. Have fun in Choco Town, whatever that place is. Okay. Aw, uh, haven't been able to speak to Dad, unfortunately. Okay. Visit our house. Anything interesting here? TV? No. Okay, sink, <laughs> time to wash the dishes, okay, okay, what does this sign say, Asia's house, <laughs> I'm just, huh, this house is my house and not my parents' house, okay, good to know I have my own property, <laughs> Okay, I hear that scientists are making great strides in the fields of parallel realities. Oh my goodness, parallel realities. Isn't science incredible? I know, man. It is. It is incredible. Oh, Chikorita, Cyndaquil, and Totodile, the Johto starters. Offering an Unod until Professor Willow imported new ones from the nearby Sinnoh region. Oh, so these were the original starters, and then Professor Willow imported the Sinnoh starters, so Chimchar, Turtwig, and Piplup. Most regions only offer three starters, but Professor Willow lets you choose from five what? What are the other two? Chimchar, Piplup, Turtwig, Bidoof? Starly? I don't know. <laughs> but, okay, which will you pick? I don't know, man. We'll see, we'll see. I've heard that some Pokemon live in trees and can only be knocked out of out of them with a special attack. Headbutt, if I remember correctly. Okay, let's visit this house. Hello there. Hello, you seem like an aspiring Pokemon trainer, am I right? Although I haven't 
team you picked your starter Pokemon yet? You'd like to show me the starter Pokemon you can choose? Sure, man. This is Turtwig, the Tiny Leaf Pokemon. Its ability is Overgrow. It evolves into Grottle at level 18 and Torterra at level 32. I might pick Turtwig because I haven't used Turtwig in a very, very long time. This is Chimchar, the Chimp Pokemon. Its ability is Blaze. It evolves into Monferno at level 14 and Infernape at level 36. Yeah, I've always used Chimchar because in Sinnoh playthroughs, Chimchar is, I think, the best starter to pick. And this is Piplup, the Penguin Pokemon. Its ability is Torrent. It evolves into Piplup at level 16 and then Polion at level 36. Oh, Shinx! That's one of the five starters. Okay, the Flash Pokemon. Its ability is Intimidate. It evolves into Luxio at level 15 and Luxury at level 30. Hmm. Should I pick it, Shinx? What's the last one? Oh, Riolu! Oh, okay. <laughs> the Emanation Pokemon. Its ability is Inner Focus. It evolves into Lucario at level 25. Also, oh, no friendship evolutions? That's great. <laughs> that's that's great. That's That's very good. I hate friendship evolutions. Good luck. Thanks, thanks. Thanks for the tip. Okay, uh, hello. Our daughter spends most of her time in front of the TV. That might worry some, but she watches many documentaries. She's very knowledgeable about Pokemon. Yep, she definitely is. Okay, how about you? If your Pokemon are feeling weak, I hear Professor Willow has a healing machine in this lab. Oh, how convenient, Professor. I wish I had one of those in my house. Okay, apparently I can't... I don't have the running shoes yet, so hopefully we'll get that sooner rather than later. Have you ever experienced the joy of cooking? I've heard that puffins are quite popular in the Sinnoh region. You should try making them sometime. Yeah, I've not really experienced puffin making in the Sinnoh region because... I don't know, I just didn't have much time, I guess. He might not look it, but my husband is quite the chef. I've never tasted more delicious food than what he's cooked. Well, congratulations, you found the one. My guy, I applaud your excellence in the culinary arts. Okay, so... Is the lab here? Oh, this is the beach. Hiya. If you squint really hard, you can see across the channel all the way to North Coast Town. I'm squinting really hard right now, but I still can't see a thing. But okay, I'll make sure to go to North Coast Town sometime soon. Okay, let me read the sign. Professor Velosam. Okay, obviously this is the place we need to go. Oh, NPCs. Hiya. Hello, young one. Today is such a nice day. Perfect day beginning a journey, eh? Well, indeed it is. Forest Pass lies just beyond here. It's just got wild Pokemon, so be careful. Okay, I'm not gonna go there since I don't have a Pokemon yet. Time to get our starter. I know the professor has a friend called the Inventor. Oh, interesting. But I wonder what his real name is. I guess Thomas Edison? <laughs> I don't know. How about you? Most people think it's easy doing research, but it's actually hard work. It takes almost 15 minutes to find the right book. Okay, man. Okay, how about you? I'm trying to see if there's a way to make a more portable healing machine. That's what I was talking about earlier. For traveling trainers too far from a Poké Center. So far, the work's pretty slow. Aw. Well, good luck on your endeavors, my friend. Professor, I'm here. Ah, you made it. I was getting worried you wouldn't show up. Um... I just had to talk to the locals, Professor. I believe you just got your trainer's license yesterday. So I'm here to give you your very own Pokemon companion. Oh, we have a license? I did not know that. <laughs> okay, this machine has five Pokeballs in it. Pick whichever you want. Make sure you choose carefully. This will be your new best friend after all. Well, okay then, Professor. 
Which turtle will you choose? Turtle egg, Jim Char, Pepwop, Shinx, or Riolu? I'm really hmm, leaning towards Turtwig or Ryulu. Hmm. Okay, let's just go with Turtwig. I it's the first Pokemon besides Mew from the title screen I saw from this game, so Turtwig it is. Are you sure you want to choose this as your starter Pokemon? Yes, Professor. Obtain Turtwig. It seems excited. Good to know! Would you like to give a nickname to Turtwig? Yes, since this is a Nuzlocke, I have to name my Pokemon. So it's a male Turtwig. Hmm... What should I name it? It's a, a turtle. It is grass. I'll name it Echo. Kinda like Ecology. Some, something like that. Echo Park, but spelled like Echo, like, like that. Echo, but it's Echo. Okay, Echo. Echo the Turtwig. Welcome to the team, my friend. Ah, you picked Turtwig. I've always had a special fondness for Turtwig. I'd usually give you a Pokédex, but I just gave my last one out a few days ago and haven't received any more. Well. Who's gonna give me the Pokédex then, Professor? I have a friend called the Inventor who lives in Chocotown. I believe he has a spare Pokédex or two. Would you mind seeing him? I don't mind at all, Professor. If your Pokémon are feeling weak, feel free to talk to the aide near the healing machine. Safe travels, Asia. Thank you so much, Professor. Okay, so let's now check my, my beloved Echo. Welcome to the team, buddy. Oh, that's that's a nice feature. The the type the typing has an icon. Interesting. Timid nature. What does timid do? Timid. I guess I'll check later after I'm done recording with this. What uh what stats it raises or decreases? So we have tackle and withdraw. I really love the icons. Okay, echo the. Timid Turtwig. Okay, let's begin our Pokemon journey. Oh my goodness, this is very slow since we don't have the running shoes. Excuse me, young lady! It seems like there's quite a ruckus down this route. My eyes weren't what they once was, unfortunately, so I can't really tell for sure, but I thought I should give you a heads up. Okay. I'm guessing there's a Pokemon? I think is that a Pokemon? Pokemon? Sean! It's not a Pokemon, but it is a potion. Oh, a Pikachu. Go on, shoe, let us pass! Pika pee, pika pee! <laughs> Stop! Stop harassing my parents! Hey Pikachu! Quit harassing my parents and let them through! Pika Pika! <laughs> The Pikachu attack! Oh no! It has a scarf! Probably has an owner. I don't know. Oh god, it looks like his neck got chopped off or something. But anyways, our first fight. Okay, so we tackle. Our attack felt great. <laughs> Okay, that, I guess this is a three hit KO. Okay, we're gonna be here a while. <laughs> I mean, since we don't have Pokeballs yet, this is not counted as an encounter. Because the Pokemon Nuzlocke only begins when you receive your Pokeballs. So, since we don't have Pokeballs yet, technically the Nuzlocke hasn't begun yet, so... Echo gained 28 XP, nice! P! Pikachu! Okay, Pikachu! Oh no, he's gonna wreck havoc on my hometown. That's bad. Asia, that was fantastic! You're an amazing battle! Thank you, Mom! I know, I know! <laughs> I had a feeling Professor Willow would be giving you a Pokemon, so me and your father got you some presents for your journey. Jo I'm, I'm sorry, sorry. Journey! <laughs> 
journey. Okay. Here you go. This is my gift. Please be running shoes. Yes! Obtain the running shoes. They fit like a glove. But they're shoes though. That was the best pair of running shoes I could find. I hope you like them. If you want to run, just hold down the B button. Yes, mom. Don't worry. I won't forget. They're great for a speedy travel. I was waiting for this. Your dad has a gift for you as well. Oh, really? I'm not good at getting gifts, but I thought you could use one of these. It's very useful. Oh my lord. The experience share this early? Dad, you might not be good at giving gifts, but this is a very, very good gift. I also got new batteries for your clock. Do you have the time? Uh, yeah, Dad, uh, I have the time. The time now is 10.30. So, yeah, 10.30. Wait, is this 10.30? Yeah, it is 10.30. 10.30. Yep. Alright, thanks, Asia. We better head on for... We better head on... We better head on home now before that crazy Pikachu comes back. You be careful, Dad, because the Pikachu went... The way... Our house is located, or at least the town where our house is located, so be careful. Listen, now that you have your own Pokemon, why not challenge the gym leaders of Toonon? Just a thought, but having a goal while traveling makes the journey that much more exciting. I agree. If I remember correctly, there's a gym in Ocean View City. Safe travels, thank you mom and dad. Be careful of the Pikachu. Okay. Ocean View City? Okay, first. A Talo. This is not counted because we don't have Pokeballs yet, so we are free to, to demolish this Talo. Oh my goodness. Oh! Okay. Echo. Come on, Echo. Come on. Come on, buddy. Okay, one more Echo, one more. Don't die, don't die, Echo. Okay, nice, nice job, my friend. 16 XP, nice, level 6. Good job, my friend. Okay. Forest Pass, Glenwood Town, Chocolate Town. I might have to heal first. Since the next town might be... Quite far from here. Oh, this is the place. I'm not. <laughs> Our house doesn't have a healing machine. This guy has a healing machine. Yes. Let's see if this works. Yep, it works. It was a complete success. Everyone seems happy and healthy. I wish you safe travels. Thank you very much. So we're going to go to the next town, which apparently is Ocean View, if I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's go here. Question mark, question mark, question mark. Oh no, it's that guy again. Coming through! Oh, it's not the same guy. Oh, he has a Cyndaquil, that's cool. Hey, you there! I heard that there was a Pikachu around here. Yep, I demolished it. Have you seen it? Yep. Yeah, I just scared it off. Oh, we can speak. Very nice. What? Grumble. In that case, who are you? My name is Asia. Well, my name is Percy, and this is my partner, Cyndaquil. Oh, Percy and his Cyndaquil. Interesting. Since we missed that Pikachu, how about we battle instead? What do you say, Cyndaquil? Oh, Quill! Cyndaquil! <laughs> okay, then. We're both fired up. Let's battle! Okay, Percy. Okay, then. Oh, he has blue sprite, but but man, he looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. He has a level 5 Cyndaquil, okay. It's a good thing we healed up, because apparently he has a fire type, so. Okay, let's tackle. Leer, oh, oh no. I mean, we still technically don't have Pokeballs, so if we did lose this, doesn't matter. Since the Nuzlocke doesn't begin until we have Pokeballs. Okay, tackle one more time. Echo, please, don't die. 
Yes! We defeated our first... I, I'm assuming this guy's our rival. Rival battle. Echo gained 69 XP. Nice. Okay, level 7. Excellent. Player defeated Pokemon Trainer Percy. Haha! <laughs> Holy smokes! Oh. Got 200. Okay. Yowzers! <laughs> this guy has very good expressions, to say the least. You're tough. You'll... You'll definitely... Oh, God. Um, hmm. First, um, journey, that now definitely, but sure. You'll definitely be a worthy rival for me. Okay, he is our rival. Since that Pikachu's gone, I'll head to Ocean View City. Okay. See you around, Asia. See you around, too, Percy. Okay, um, I guess that's where... This is where we'll be ending the first episode, then. So, if you did enjoy that, please leave a like, you know, maybe subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Peace out.